you want to make us that quest, then you got to sing a silly song. Oh, yeah. StatQuest. Hello, I'm Josh Starmer, and welcome to StatQuest. Today, we're going to talk about how to make your own StatQuest. Step zero, research your topic. Believe me, this is the hardest and most time-consuming part. That said, here are my tips on how to research your topic. First, read everything you can find on the topic. Then, reread everything, and you might have to do this multiple times. Then, if there is a Python module or R package that implements the topic, use it. Does it do what you expect? And why not? Answering this question is when the deep learning and understanding happens. Then, try to find something new to say or show about the topic. Now we're ready for step one. Make the slides. Personally, I like to use Keynote to make slides. But I started out using PowerPoint, and that works too. Keynote has an equation editor that makes mathematical symbols look nice. However, I usually write out the equations as text because I think they are easier to read. And I almost always draw graphs by hand because I need them to be easy to interpret on cell phone sized screens. Note, I focused your attention on the graph by covering the text and arrows with a semi transparent white box. Bam! Now we're ready for step two export slides as images and import them into Final Cut Pro or iMovie or whatever you're using. To export slides as images, we go to the File menu, Export to, Images. And for some reason, I like to export the images as PNG files. You click Next, and then Export. Boop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. Bam! Now, to import them into Final Cut Pro, we switch to Final Cut Pro and click on the Import button, which is this arrow. Click Import All. Bam! Now, we just select all the images and drag them into the timeline. Check it out. Double bam! And now we're finally ready to record the voiceover. In Final Cut Pro, you can record the voiceover by going to the Window menu and selecting Record Voiceover. Now click on the Record button. And now we're finally ready to record the voiceover. Bam! Nope, not yet. Lastly, you need to record a silly song. If you want to make a stack quest, then you got to sing a silly song. Oh, yeah. Stack quest. Triple bam. Now let's quickly talk about my gear. When I first started out, I did everything on my Apple laptop. It came with Keynote and iMovie, and I recorded the voiceover using the built-in microphone. My most popular video of all time, PCA Step by Step, was made this way. However, now I have an iMac and a fancy microphone, the Shure SM7B, and I connect the fancy microphone to the iMac with an audio interface. In this case, I've got something called an Audient ID14, which is pretty much overkill for StatQuest, but I like it anyways. Bam. And that's all there is to it. Now you can make your own StatQuest. Bam! Now it's time for some shameless self-promotion. If you want to review statistics and machine learning offline, check out the StatQuest study guides at statquest.org. There's something for everyone. Hooray! We've made it to the end of another exciting StatQuest. If you like this StatQuest and want to see more, please subscribe. And if you want to support StatQuest, consider contributing to my Patreon campaign, becoming a channel member, buying one or two of my original songs or a t-shirt or a hoodie, or just donate. The links are in the description below. All right, until next time, quest on.